Hey guys, this is GP Hero here, and I'm here to show y'all something that, you know, I don't think I've ever shown anybody, at least not on my channel. <laughs> um, this was actually a video suggested to me a few weeks ago. Um, let's get to it. As y'all can see, I have a collection of pens. Majority of them are Disney pens. But bear with me the best you can, because to be honest, I don't quite remember where I got all of these. So, let's see what we're working with here. I know where I got most of them. And some were just like, you know, back and forth, uh, thingamabob, thingies, that kind of good stuff. <clears throat> I started collecting these when I was 15 years old, in 2011. And, most, and every one of these, I have these in the exact order that I got them in. <clears throat> so, let's get to it. Very first one. 2011 December of 2011 and this one both in the same day I bought it Disney's Hollywood Studios which it will always be MGM Studios to me <laughs> um yeah these are my very first two then pretty much I got addicted afterwards if you can't tell these three right here got for Christmas that same year um this one right here I would hope most of y'all know what WWJE stands for. <laughs> um, my grandfather actually gave this one to me. And then I want to say that probably from this one to this one right here, I got these in 2012. I believe I bought them at the pen store that, that downtown Disney, or is, it's now called Disney Springs. I don't like that, but it's whatever. Um, yeah. I purchased that from there, purchased those from there. And then, I'm sure most of y'all have heard that are Disney fans, that Epcot has the the food and wine festival of every year. Of course, at that time, I wasn't old enough to drink, but I was old enough to eat. So, yeah. This was from the same year, a few months later. Um, I don't remember exactly where this one came from. But I want to say that it's very possible that my grandmother gave it to me for a Christmas one, or maybe my birthday. I want to say Christmas, because my birthday's in July, and we would always go in September. Or actually, no, we went in October that year. This one was given to me sometime during my Boy Scout years. I want to say that's my Scout pen, if I'm just a regular, like, the rank of Scout. I can't quite remember. It's been so long. And then this one to probably... I want to say this one were Christmas presents. And then, um, wait, what else did I do in 012? No, I went back to Orlando in 2000, in December of that same year. That was when, so I guess I got these mixed up. I don't, I don't know. I know I traded a few of these because I used to be a pen trader. Um, this one was actually a pen of the year one. I remember them quite well. This one I also bought at that same trip along with this one. And then I want to say from probably this one to maybe this one were some that I think I traded. Oh, except for this one. My grandmother gave me this one. And then um, it was either that year or the next year from these two right here I bought the well look at this this was from the hotel that we stayed in quite a few times Disney's Pop Century watch this this is pretty cool if I can if I can get it to spin yeah a shoe whoops no I didn't sneeze if I said a shoe and it fell off <laughs> about that basically what Pop Century is it's a whole generation of different centuries like from the 50s to I want to say the 90s look at that oh well yeah you know, I'm gonna put that on the bowling pin that's cool um this is probably just one I bought along with this one because I like seeing Donald Duck angry because he's my favorite Disney character and seeing Goofy fall is just hilarious to me my younger brother actually gave me this one and then going into 2013 this is one of the pin of the years I believe I actually purchased it online, and then I bought a second one and gave it to someone I don't any longer associate with, but wait a minute, I'm such an idiot. I I skipped the rose. 
I'm a huge Lion King fan, so this is a given right here. This one right here. I never did figure out who this character is, but he's so adorable. I just call him the orange bird. And then from these, actually, we're going all the way to this one. All um, Christmas gifts. This one was, I guess, just when I went down there in 2013. Got this one at the Rock and Roller Coaster. If you've never been on it, you don't know what you're missing out on. Okay, now I got it. I think these two are ones that I traded first for something else. I don't remember. Now we're on these, and I already said all these, so. I believe this one was another pin of the year, along with this one. This one used to have a sticker at one point. It supported the Tampa Bay Lightning. Um... I'm not sure where I got this one, come to think of it. I, I, as I said, please bear with me. I do not remember where I got all of these. Um, this one I may have bought or else was a Christmas gift. This one right here, I, I bought it because I used to play the game Angry Birds and this got me to thinking of it. And then this right here, because I love trains, it's perfect and even has Donald on it too. Don't really remember where I, oh, oh, I just noticed that. Look at that. I don't remember where I got this one either. These right here, I know for a fact these were given to me because these pens are older than I am. Um, and I love them. And this, I think, was another pen of the year. Basically what a pen of the year is, is you'll go to the pen shop down at Disney Springs and you ask them what their pens of the year are going to be, and they'll give you the suggestion to either, um, you know, choose to purchase it or not. Oh, man. There it goes again. On all these from right here, I purchased these. Or, or excuse me, I got that mixed. Or, I purchased this one. And this one, that one, and these two were all given to me. Actually, this one I traded as well. <laughs> That's a really old one, too. And this right here, Soren, one of my absolute favorite rides at Disney of all time. It's so beautiful. This is my number one favorite ride, especially since it's now owned by General Motors. It has been for a while, and I love that. Chevy's Rock. So I already went through these. I need to organize these a little bit better. Um, I don't remember where I got this one. This is another pin of the year. This one was given to me after I graduated because I graduated in 2014. And then I want to say probably from this one to probably all the way to this one. Maybe this one, I don't know. It's been so long, so please just bear with me. Every one of these, I believe, were given to me. Of course, Dale on the train, I like that a lot. And my brother being a huge Peter Pan fan, of course, I'm going to support him. Well, he was a Peter Pan fan when he was younger. I don't know. Both of these were pen of the year. Um, and um, this one was given to me. I actually had lost it for a while and then I found it again. This one, very similar to that one. I love the fact that Walt it, on the Walt Disney himself is on these pictures of the pens. If I can get any more, I'll be happy. Uh, you know what, I'm gonna fix this one right now. Oop, uh, if I can. I've had this cork board since I was in elementary school, and I finally put it to good use when I first started buying these. This one supports autism awareness, and I'm very proud to own this one. Aw, take Riley to the moon for me. Admit it, you cried. And then this one right here, oh, by the way, yeah, I got a lot of these in 2015. That was a good year for me. This one right here. This actually goes based on the movie um, Tomorrowland. Good movie. That pen looks very similar. So, yeah. Oh, wow. I just realized I had two of these. <laughs> Quite frankly, I don't know where all these even came from anymore. Um, pen of the year. Bought that one because it looked cute. Oh, Tampa Bay Lightning. There we go. All right, just so I can verify some, this is not a pen. It is a birthday card. <laughs> Isn't it obvious? I hope so. That was actually for my 17th birthday. 
And then this one I bought at Universal, I think, in 2018, if I'm not mistaken. Um, and I think this one, the same year, um, was another pin of the year, if I'm not mistaken. And that, I don't know what that is. I think it's a nose. <laughs> so yeah, that's all my pins that I've collected over the years. And now I'm almost 25 years old and I've been collecting them since I was 15. Daggum, almost 10 years. Gang, um, I'm so old. Well, this is going to be the end for tonight. This, this is all I got for you tonight. Um, I got more coming for y'all soon. So, I hope you guys have a great night. And I hope y'all enjoyed this video. And we'll keep in touch. This is GP Hero signing out. And we'll see you next time.